Hey everyone, it's Presley at BackToItGames.com here, and it's Science Sunday, and today we're going to be opening the new Spangler Science Club kit. So this is the March kit, and I'm really excited to find out what's inside, so let's open it up. Let's hope I can open it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. actually open it first. And here is the Top Secret Parents Guide, which I can't look at, so I'm going to put it over there. And then the guide that I use here. The It's called Science Magic. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Bubble wrap things. Okay, I don't want to touch them because they're bubble wrap, but I'm going to take them out for you guys. Ooh, a jar with window screening on the top, and this um, root beer bottle, which I don't want to take, because I kind of don't want to take it out because it's all because it's glass and the bubble wrap thing is difficult. Wait, there we go. And this is like my afternoon probably popping this bubble wrap, to be honest. There we go. This, I'm going to be extremely careful with those because I don't want to destroy them. Balloons, I like balloons. Um, so paper that's like your Spangler Science Club kit, blah, blah, blah. So stuff like that. Ooh. More window screen. I don't know if that's window screen or just greeny things. Uh, bouncy balls that look like blueberries. I can't tell what that is. It's like a wooden ball and toothpicks. And, ooh, there's lots of stuff in here. Um, do not remove this card. Okay, sorry. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just leave you there. Ooh, so this is another science thing. Step one, think of any number between one and nine. Okay, so it's like more instruction on this on that stuff. Turn over for your prediction. Okay, so it's like some sort of magical prediction thing, which I'll check out in Um, And wooden dowels. Ropes. There's a lot of stuff in this kit. And sandpaper. So we're gonna, you know, look at the book and tell you what kind of stuff that we can do and show you some cool stuff. So it's another one of those really cool kits that are kind of a magic show with science, which I really love because, well, it's awesome. I love seeing the magic show and the sciencey stuff going on. So you can kind of see the magic behind the science show. And it's really cool. And most of these, you probably, well, w don't want to do it alone. It's more fun with another person. So I am going to have some help from my lovely assistant. So my dad's going to be helping me with a couple of these tricks. Yep. So all you have to do for this one is just do what I do. So the kit came with a bottle and two strings, and you have to supply the second bottle yep. because it didn't come with a second bottle. So we supplied the second bottle here. Okay. So like I said, all you have to do is do what I'm doing. All right. So first, you put your string into your bottle. I can do that. Yeah, it's not hard. Yep. You put it in the bottle, uh -huh. and then turn it upside down. Okay. Oops. And let it go. Sure okay, what did he wrong? I don't know. Let's try it again. All right. So, into the bottle. All right. In the bottle. Hold. Turn upside down. Yep. Got it. And let go. Okay. I'm not sure what's wrong with you. Can you hold that for me? Yeah. Wait a minute. Look. Uh, but it has something to do with the bottle that came with the kit. I so think that's what it is. I think this will work. Yeah. You ready? So we're gonna switch our bottles. All right. So, boop, boop, boop. In. Here's mine. Turn it over. Ready? And let go. Hey. <laughs> I'm still working. <laughs> it likes me. All right. So how are you doing? Okay. So I was cheating a little bit. I have a genie in my bottle. A genie in your yes, bottle. Yes. That's holding into. My, that's holding on my string from uh -huh. the bottom. Okay. And I'm not sure I'll buy that. Yeah. Just in case you don't believe me, I'm gonna do another experiment that proves that I have a genie that I can control in the bottle that I'm using. All right. Let's see it. So I'm going to show you another trick that I really do have a genie in this bottle that I can control. So he does what I want, like he holds the string when I want and stuff like that. But the one thing he really hates is being sealed in his bottle. Okay. So I'm going to seal in his bottle using this bottle, which came with the kit, mm -hmm. and the, this um, pipette, which came with the kit. Okay. And we had to supply the penny and the water. Okay. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So first I'm going to put the penny onto the bottle. Here we go. Oops. Got it in there wrong. Okay. And then I'm going to really seal him in there with this water. Alright. Okay. Boop. 
Okay, that's very sealed. That's sealed in well. Now he's gonna try and get out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> Okay, how does that work? How does that work? Yeah. Well, there's a G in the bottle. <laughs> okay, Presley, this is a science kit. Tell me how it really works. All right, fine. So what's happening is the bottle was just, whoa. Wow, that was a big one. <laughs> the bottle is just frozen. Uh-huh. So the bottle is cold, if you feel it, it's cold. Oh, it is cold, all right. Yes, the yep. bottle's cold. Gotcha. So when air heats up, it expands. Right. So the air is trying to get out of the bottle and it kind of flips the penny and pressures and pushes it mm. to get out of the bottle. I got you. So when you put your hands on it, you're making it warmer. Yeah, I'm warming it up. And, and the air is expanding and it pushes the penny. Yeah. Clever. Mm -hmm. Pretty slick. So this is a bonus trick that did not come in the kit, but I learned about it off of T. Spengler's website. And it's kind of about tricking your friends, which is why it fits into a seam, as well as it requires a bottle. And then the kit reminded me of this experiment. Okay. So let's see if Dad can do it. All right. So here's how you do it. Is What you need is a bottle, a straw, the cap that came with the bottle, and then you fold it up like a taco. Then you're going to lay the bottle down. Put the cap just, just into the bottle, and I challenge you to blow the cap into the bottle. With the straw? Yeah. Okay. That seems easy enough, yeah? Mm-hmm. All right. Ready? <laughs> Let's try that again. Nailed it too hard. Mm -hmm. Softer? Maybe. Okay. Not Okay, what's going on? Okay, should I tell you what's going on? Yeah, please do. Okay, okay. Um, so what's going on is the bottle is not empty. It's filled. It's filled with air. Oh, it's got air in it. Yep. It's got air in it, of no. course. Mm -hmm. Um, so when you put the cap, so when you put the cap in it and try and blow, you're putting more air inside, but it's already full, so it pushes a little bit of the air out, which brings the cap with it. Mm, that makes sense. Yes. I gotta admit that's a pretty cool trick. <laughs> I totally thought you could blow the cap in there. I didn't even think about it. <laughs> yeah. And my friends are coming over in a couple of days, so I'm definitely excited to play those tricks on them and see if what they think about what's going on. Awesome. Really cool, Pucha. Mm -hmm. I like those. Mm -hmm. Nice. As always, this is just a tiny bit of what comes in the kit. There's a ton of stuff that comes in the kit, and we only showed you a teensy little bit, plus the bonus trick that I threw in because you can do it with most of the stuff in the kit. So it's really amazing. There'll be a link in the doobly-doo to the Steve Spangler Science Club website where you can sign up for it. And you can sign up for it and it'll get delivered to you. I'm sure you'll really love it. So yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. It's time to press the subscribe button. A subscribe button. A subscribe button. A subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Bye, 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 bye.